Welcome to Tech Manomial. This video is about how to navigate from one page to particular section of the another page called a fragment. A fragment is an internal page reference which specifies a particular location within a page. Sometimes we may need to navigate to the particular section of the page instead of start of the page. These are also called as named anchors. In simple word we can say some name is assigned to particular section of the page. Using that name as a reference we can navigate to that particular section. Here you will see how to implement this in an ionic angular application. So let's start. Create an ionic angular application and add here the pages like details, home and notes. The simple command to add the page is like then in the assets, create the list of images called the thumbnails. Just add here the name of the images. Now in the details page, make some imports. So import the image list from the constants. We need the activated root and the ion content. Take the view a reference for the ionic content using the view child and create the object for the activate root. Now this this is our ion content tag. Then add the grid, rows and columns. Iterate here through the image list and we will display the images. Note here that I am assigning here the ID which is nothing but the thumbnail image name. Add the image tag. Now showing the details page which display the list of images. For the another page in the TypeScript import the activated root ion content then take the reference of the ionic content with the view child and just create the object for the activated root just create the three section for the article like of text you note that for the first section i am assigning here the id as a one in a string format for the second part or second section numeric 2 as id so we define here the three sections for the home page so simply add here the grid to display the image list and display it into the image now for the articles or notes add simply the list of the links The list of the thumbnail is displayed here and list of the anchor tags for the navigation here. Now in the home page TypeScript file import the navigation extras, navigation controller, create the object for the navigation controller. Then on image click, so define this method here which takes image name as a parameter then using the navigation extra specify this image name as a fragment and provide here the name of the page where you want to navigate now here specify id as a fragment and this is the name of the page now in the details page typescript file Add the ionic view did enter event. Now what will be the QR fragment here? The name of the fragment that we will provide while the navigation. Like the name of image or ID of the article. Then calculate the Y position of that particular anchor or fragment. And scroll by point method 
will scroll the page to particular that fragment position. So similar method we will add inside the another page that is the notes page. Let's run this application. Select this image, click on it. Say you are now at the thumbnail 9 image. Say a last image. Now check for the notes. Let's say ionic input. So see that this particular section is shown here. So now you get it directly to that section. Now when you click on particular image, check the URL. It will show you hash thumbnail 4. This is the name of the image with the hashtag. Now if you click on introduction to ionic, again it's a showing hash 1 because it's in a string format. But if I am passing it as a numeric, let's say platform, so you will not get that number in the URL. These are the thumbnail images. Just try to click any particular image. Just click on any link. So it's the platform section. So friends, it is how you can navigate to particular section of the page using the fragment sections. If you really like the videos, please subscribe to the channel. Your likes and comments really encourage me a lot. So please subscribe the channel and don't forget to like this video. Thank you. Bye-bye.